Hi everyone, this is Ashley, uh, the DM for Nat Awesome. Um, I primarily use Arkenforge for my map uh, building and was really excited when they came out with the Towns and Cities modular homes. Um, one thing that I did notice is that when you place them, the roof is on a separate layer. Um, and I, I wanted it on the same layer, that way I can control um, if my players can see into a certain building or not by hiding the roof um, using the cogwheel to hide asset from uh, players. So I'm going to take you through how to do that. Um, hope you guys enjoy, give me a thumbs up um, and a like, and let's get started. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to do is I'm just going to grab a random house. Um, here you can see I already have some that I went through this process with. Um, okay, so I'm just going to go ahead and place this down nearby so you guys can see what it looks like when you place it originally. Uh, it places, uh, and these ones are the unfurnished, there are furnished versions. Um, so first we're just going to select this whole thing. We're going to unlock it. Um, if you can't click on it, uh, hold shift and click or select the whole tile area and then it'll pop up the cogwheel for you. Um, so unlock the tile. We're also going to ungroup it. Uh, and one thing I'm going to take care of before I move the roof down is this red line. When you move the roof down and you still leave the red line, then you will see it through the roof. And if you're not putting anything inside of the building, I don't really think it's necessary and it's just a kind of a distracting line. So go ahead and get rid of that first. Zoom in as much as you can so you are only clicking on the red line and then just hit delete. And that will get rid of the uh, red line area for you. And we'll do that on all of them. If you want to select more than one of them at a time, you can also do that by uh, selecting the first one and then hitting control and selecting the other red line and that way you can just delete them all at the same time. Okay, now that we got that cleared up, I'm going to select the whole thing and I'm going to group them. So now this makes it so this is all one piece and you can kind of see the roof under, well that's technically the layer above. So let's go up there and grab that. So this should now be unlocked. It is also ungrouped. So first we're going to group everything together. That way it is one piece that you can move around. And now we're going to drop it down a layer. And now we can move the house out of the way first and then regroup it together. And now you can grab the roof and place it over the top. And this is what I wanted to be able to do is to hide it so that when I go into the uh, player's view, I would be able to for the, I would be able to hide the roof if they were able to go inside or not. So that would that's what it would look like um, from the top now on a single layer. Hope you guys enjoyed.